and away from security matters. And Abuja-based research institute, Africa Poland Institute, has advocated accurate data of persons living with disabilities in the country. The executive director of the institute, Professor Bel Ihua, says if this is done, it will improve their living conditions and better their lives. The report is presented from our studio. It is a one-day multi-stakeholders workshop by the Nigerian Disability Research Project in Abuja. The project is born out of the need to have Nigerian-owned data on people with disabilities and the project is aimed at gathering evidence-based disaggregated data that will create useful data that can be quoted for many years to come. The group advises states that are yet to domesticate the Disability Act to do so and ensure speedy implementation of the Act. Data is life. And uh, because data is life, I think one of the challenges that have been found so far that has not allowed the inclusion of people with disability is the fact that there have been little data from the country on people with disability. So with the support of Ford Foundation, um, Africa Poland Institute was asked to midwife the process of generating national data. In our remarks, the National President Joint National Association of Persons with Disabilities, Ekaiti Umo, says the outcome of the research would help people with disabilities have their constructive engagements with the government. For a very long time in the Nigerian community, we've been struggling with data. This is the very first time that we're going to have this kind of indigenous research, and we are actually looking forward to it. We believe that the outcome of this research will help us to have some kind of constructive engagement. Chief Executive Officer of the Albino Foundation, Jake Ekpele, commended the project. He says the outcome will be excellent and beneficial to the community of PWDs. We are hopeful and uh, trust that the outcome of this project uh, will be excellent and beneficial to the community. Um, this is one of those projects that reached out to the right people, uh, the best and the brightest within the community. And like we have received as a promise, and, and I trust he keeps his word. The call for all inclusiveness cannot be overemphasized, and such a project as this is only a pointer in the right direction. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.